In this video, we will teach you the basics of how to configure an individual sensor or multiple sensors using Pactware and an on-machine TBEN block IO-Link master. In this example, we are using the TBEN-L5-8IOL IO-Link master and Pactware to configure an IO-Link BCT capacitive sensor. In this example, you will need an IO-Link master block module. In this case, we are using a TBEN L5-8 IOL, an IO-Link sensor. In this case, we are going to configure an IO-Link BCT capacitive sensor, a 24 volt DC power supply cable, a double-ended M12 cord set to connect the sensor to your IO-Link master, an ethernet cord set, and a laptop or PC. If you do not currently have Turk Software Manager, you can download it by going to www.turk.com forward slash TSM. First, let's download and install the necessary software. With Turk Software Manager opened, click the plus symbol next to IO Link and check the following selection boxes. DTM for field bus IO systems. If you haven't done so already, you should also install Packware and the IODD DTM configurator. This process is reviewed in the previous IO-Link video. Click the download button and follow the installation prompts. With these items downloaded and installed, open the IODD DTM configurator. Select Add IODDs from IODD Finder. Select Hans Turk GMBH. Lastly, select the IODD for the product family of the IO-Link sensor we are trying to configure. In this example, we are using the BCT IO-Link capacitive sensor. Once the IODDs are selected, you can select Add Selected IODD. We now have all the necessary software. Now let's assemble the hardware. With the M12 cord set, plug the BCT sensor into the TBEN L5 8IOL IO-Link master. In this case, it will be plugged into port 7. Next, connect the TBEN L5 8 IOL to a 24 volt DC power supply. You will notice the LEDs on the block will light up. The next step is to connect the TBEN L5 8 IOL IOLink master to your PC using an Ethernet cord set. We first need to configure the Ethernet port on the PC. You can do this by going to the control panel on your PC and then accessing Network and Sharing Center. Click on the local area connection your block is plugged into and click Properties. In the local area connection properties window, select Internet Protocol Version 4 and then select Properties. Ensure the IP address is within the 192.168.1 subnet. To configure the sensor in Pactware, open Pactware. Select Device, Add Device, select BL Service Ethernet, then select OK. In the project window, double click on BL Service Ethernet. Ensure that the local area connection being used is selected. Then select the I symbol. The part number for the TBEN IOLink Master should now appear under device type. Next, select Add Device slash DTM to Project. You will notice that the project window will be populated with the device and the various IOLink ports. Right click on port 7 and select Add Device. In the pop up window, select the product series of the device you are trying to configure. Then select OK. In the project window, right click on the product and select Connect. Once again, right click on the product and select Parameter. The parameter window will open. Here's where we change the IOLink device configuration. To read the current configuration of the sensor, select the Read from the Device button. In this example, we will change the sensor to have a normally closed switch point behavior. To store the sensor configuration into the sensor, select Write to Device. The IOLink device is now configured. Thanks for watching.